Welcome back into the Coach's Corner. I'm joined now with Dave Trumbo, women's volleyball head coach. And Coach, you you opened up last week with uh, McDaniel at home and beat them 3-0. You talk a little bit about that game. Yeah, McDaniel's are always a big one for us because the confer- you know, they're rivals, not conference rivals, but they're big mm-hmm. rivals from right up the street. Mm-hmm. And uh, they've done a, a great job bringing their program back. And to be able to beat them uh, on our home floor with just a phenomenal crowd, yeah. uh, it was fun. And the first mat- first set was really close, a two-point victory. But after that, we settled down a little bit mm-hmm. and played a little bit better and uh, did a good job. And talking about close matches, uh, this weekend you go out and play some really quality teams. Um, that are you know going to be your gear up for you know conference play that starts next Saturday, this Saturday, right? Um, and you played them pretty close into some deep matches. Can you talk a little bit how the weekend went? Yeah, we knew that we were going to have great competition. The, you know, the first match against Carnegie Mellon, the last two years we've gone five with Carnegie Mellon. They are much improved over the last two years, uh, ranked number 14 in the mm-hmm. country, and had them two to one. Mm-hmm. And we're feeling pretty good. And if we're not able to come up with victories in set four and five, uh, then we played Ithaca, who had uh-huh. come in and beat Carnegie Mellon at 2 o'clock. Right. <laughs> so uh, Ithaca was pretty good. We split the first two with them and just uh, were not able to close out that match. So that, you know, that was tough. We lost two. We come, then we come in. We're fired up for Salisbury the next day. Well, Salisbury was a little bit more fired up than we were. And uh, probably Salisbury was playing his best volleyball of the year and um, won the first set and was, were not able to play very well. Probably that was the most disappointing thing of the weekend. We just did not play very well as a team. It wasn't any one particular thing mm-hmm. we need to work on. Uh, I have to uh, give the girls a lot of credit. They had a players-only meeting. They mm-hmm. regrouped and just played really great volleyball against Ohio Northern. Uh, it went five, of mm-hmm. course, and unfortunately we lost 16-14. So... Now we're asking, you know, how are we going to come out of this? You know, our mm-hmm. seniors have never experienced four losses right. like this. We've never experienced competition like this. Uh, right. on, all, in one uh, all, all in one weekend. Uh, you know, the, the goal always being to improve the team, to learn more about ourselves. So as we move forward now into conference play, play Marymount on Wednesday. Mm-hmm. Uh, but we follow that with a, uh, a conference try match against Hood and Lycoming on Saturday. And then follow that with um, Albright. Mm-hmm. On Tuesday, so we've got four, three big conference matches coming up. You know, in the end, what we want to do is get first place in our conference and hopefully host the conference championship. So all this will work together in the end. It's just a little bit hard to take right, right now, right. and the girls know it was it was great competition. Uh, we really enjoyed moments. We showed moments of brilliance. Mm-hmm. Uh, Victoria Pro Kick, our uh, freshman middle, got conference or all conference. So right. you know that's a real positive, and we had some other. Um, Really, just you know, we play with just such heart. It's just disappointing we didn't come up with any victories. Right, and it, what are the the things that you'll learn from this weekend? You know, as you move into conference play. Well, I think you know how hard you have to play every point. I mean, the other teams' uh, defense were just as scrappy as we were, and we mm-hmm. just would have incredible good swings, and they come up with the ball and send it back. Mm-hmm. You know, and how hard you have to play point after point. Um, how how you have to serve. We call it, you know, serve aggressively because we don't want them to pass us very easily. The top teams can all pass and serve very well, Mm -hmm. Uh, and that kind of was proven this weekend. We had our lapses, but for the most part, we passed pretty good, and that's why the matches were pretty close. Right, and so now moving into conference play, are those the learning points that you need to really emphasize on going into conference play? Uh, I think that you know, keeping our team chemistry in, in, intact, the confidence that we play with is very important after you lose, uh, after you have a weekend like this. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I really do believe that we have very good senior leadership and uh, we'll have two practices before we play Marymount and we'll be just fine. And uh, hopefully this week, you know, it continues that success that you've, you've had, been having this season. Uh, oh, we're, that's where we're going. Right. That's where we're going, Joe. You know, we, we're, we've got um, the next ranked team we play is Eastern on October 1st, and it's at mm-hmm. home. And so that's a big advantage for us. And Eastern, if things go the way Eastern's playing, they're going to be in the top 10 by then because they swept everybody. Right. So, not didn't sweep. They lost in sets. But mm-hmm. they did. were able to win all four matches. Right. Thank you, Coach, for, for your time this week. And uh, We'll see you out on Wednesday uh, with Marymount at home. I hope I'm smiling a little bit more than I am right now. (laughs) I appreciate it, Coach. He's Dave Trumbo. I'm Joe Wamba, and this has been the Coach's Corner.